Hey, you have to gain a high value skill. What do you do for money? Do you have a digital skill? There are so many ways to make money online. What are you doing? Explore it. Productize yourself. Monetize your skill. You should monetize your money. You're leaving money on the table. Where would you start, would you start, making, start making money? What are you doing with your smartphone? You're wasting You're your, wasting data, your online. data online. Come on. I know. So many voices. But no one actually tells you how to make this money online but i'm here to do that before i start which of these questions are flooding your mind right now which of them did you ask yourself last night which of them are people bombarding you with every single day because both online and offline you hear these questions you hear people talk about these things and you ask yourself where do i start from where do I begin? Short answer, here and now. Ooh. Let me tell you this. I made my first $1,000 online. Not my first $1,000 on the internet. My first $1,000 ever. Off, on, line. And I did that from the comfort of my home. I have credibility on this topic. According to Alex Hamonzi, if they don't have what you want, don't listen to them. This is a path I have walked and I'm here to share with you the step-by-step -step process on how to earn your first $1,000 online. A practical roadmap, practical strategies to move from $0 to $1,000. But first, I have to put this out there. This is not a get-rich-quick scheme. If you're looking for a get-rich-quick scheme, this video is not for you. It's, it's okay. You can skip this one. But if you're ready for change and you're ready to put in the work, you're ready to take action, you're ready to implement the knowledge you gather from this video, then stay with me. Give this video a thumbs up. Give this video a like so it can reach a wider audience. And if you're yet to subscribe to the channel, I hope you make the decision to do so. So let's do this. Step one, get an in-demand skill. Did I forget to tell you that what made me that money was my skill? I wasn't selling any physical products. I basically offered my services to people who needed them. So you need a skill. What are these skills and where can you acquire them? I told you this is going to be a step-by-step -step process. This is step one. Now, the first skill I have to share with you is writing. Writing is broad. Writing is a versatile skill applicable across various industries. Whether it's creative writing, technical writing, copywriting, or content creation, if you can master one or two, you're good to go. You can even write resumes for people. So if you like to make money online by just writing resumes, I will leave the link to my ebook in the description where I share everything I know, everything I did, everything I'm still doing for that business. This is the ebook. I will leave the link in the description. The next skill is graphics design. Graphics design basically means combining creativity and technology to communicate ideas through visual content. This is a skill that will never be out of demand because businesses, individuals, companies will always be in need of your design skill to create visually appealing marketing materials, websites, and social media content. The next skill is digital marketing. Simply put, Digital marketing involves promoting products or services through digital channels. It involves SEO, content marketing, email marketing, affiliate marketing, I'll talk more on that, and much more. I'll create a detailed video on digital marketing. I think it's in my content calendar, yes. But for the sake of this video, you can acquire the skill on Coursera. I made a tutorial video on how to apply for financial aid on Coursera and take courses for free. So this is a paid course. The course on Coursera is a paid course, but you can take that course for free. All you need to do is to apply for financial aid. I'll leave the link to the video in the description or somewhere here. This is the video or just check it out on the channel. Okay, our next skill, which is social media management. SMM, that's social media management, involves creating, scheduling, analyzing, and engaging with content posted on social media platforms. 
This is key for businesses, individuals, content creators, influencers, for building brand presence and engaging with their audience. So people are in need of this skill. And as a social media manager, you can take on two or three clients. The next skill is affiliate marketing. This is one of the easiest skills you can learn. Affiliate marketing is a business model or a performance-based marketing where a business rewards affiliates for each of their affiliate sales. Affiliate marketing is an offset of digital marketing. I mentioned that earlier. I have a complete video on the channel about affiliate marketing, so check it out. This is the video. Yeah, I will leave the link in the description, but if I don't remember, just check out the playlist. The next skill I have to share with you is virtual assistance. Talking about easy, this is another one. One of the easiest ways to make money online, especially if you're watching this as a Nigerian, you're watching this as an African. This is one of the easiest skills on how you can start working with international clients. Virtual assistants provide administrative support to businesses and entrepreneurs from remote locations. This involves managing emails, scheduling, social media management, and so much more. Watch this video. This channel is an epitome of knowledge. All you need to do is take advantage of it. This is free education. And if you're still watching till this point, kindly give this video a thumbs up so it can benefit others, right? And the algorithm will pick up this video and spread it to a lot of people outside of your current location <laughs> okay and if you're yet subscribed to the channel i hope you make the decision to do so now before we move on to the next step remember we're talking about how you can move from zero dollar nothing to one thousand dollars before this year runs out and we're in step one which is getting a skill so before we move on to the next step let me share the last skill with you which is web development this involves building and maintaining websites i'll leave the links to where you can acquire some of these skills i mentioned in the description check them out if the one you're interested in is not there let me know in the comment section or send me a direct whatsapp message the link to my whatsapp is in the description as well okay now let's move on to the next step step two which is getting work experience now how do you get work experience when you don't even have any practical experience on these skills this is super important because you need testimonials you need receipts you need evidence from clients you've actually worked with so how do you achieve this how do you acquire these testimonials when you don't have any practical experience you're just learning the skill now my advice to you is to volunteer, to take on internship opportunities. And where can you get these? There is Catchfire, there is 4 age. I shared everything in this video, how you can get work experience when you don't have work experience. Because in today's world, you cannot get a job without work experience. And you cannot get experience without getting a job. So how do you go about it? I shared everything in this video i don't know if i'll remember to leave the link in the description but i'll keep the thumbnail somewhere here now let's move on to step three building a personal brand go on linkedin create a linkedin profile watch this video on how to do that not just how to create your linkedin profile this video will teach you how to optimize your linkedin profile to achieve an all-star profile go on linkedin create a professional brand post content post how to's articles that will make you appear like you know what you're doing of course you should know what you're doing now also go on instagram create a profile create content instagram tiktok this is where most of your clients have accounts on create content that will resonate with your potential clients create content you have to create content now let's move on to step four which is getting a client i need you to pay attention please I am going to explain this in two forms. Number one, if you're interested in getting a nine to five, then a CV is what you need here. You need to create a remote job CV, an ATS optimized CV. Now, if you want to do this alone, I don't hold information on this channel. I don't get keep. I share everything on this channel. This is the video you need to watch on how to create a remote job CV. 
But if you want me to do that for you, it's for a fee. It's not free. I have some of you who are reaching out to me and asking me questions I have answered in most of my videos on the channel, asking me to offer my services for free. I'm sorry, I can't do that. I offer consultations for a fee. I write resumes for a fee. Yet, I come on here, still share my knowledge for free, and you still come into my DM to give you a one-on-one -on -one section for free. Come on, have a conscience. You safe, get conscience. I will charge you for it, it's not free. So if you want to write a resume yourself, by all means, everything you need to know is here. If you want me to do it for you, reach out to me on WhatsApp. My WhatsApp link is in the description or Instagram and let's work together so that is it if you're looking to work a nine to five. Second phase the second form is freelancing if you're looking to work as a freelancer you don't want to work a nine to five you don't want to work for a structured company or a structured organization you want to do your own thing then you need a portfolio i don't know let me know in the comment section if you're getting what i'm saying i know this is not a lie yeah but just it's important to me that somebody understands what i am saying <laughs> if you need a nine to five cv if you want to work as a freelancer you need a portfolio okay so to create a portfolio like i said earlier i have everything for you on this channel i have a video for you on how to create a portfolio using canva for free for the cv that's what you're going to be sending to organizations when you see job openings you send it to them for your portfolio that's what you're going to be pitching to clients with you send them the link and then they go through your profile and decide if they want to work with you. Recap, if you're looking at 9 to 5, you need a CV. If you're looking to work as a freelancer, freelancing, you need a portfolio. Watch this video on how to create a remote work resume. Watch this video on how to design a portfolio for free. All right, so let's move on to the next step. Step one was to get a skill. Step two, get experience. Step three, building a personal brand. Step four, getting a client. Five is to rinse and repeat. So that's it, friends. That's how you move from zero to 1K. Let me know in the comment section if this video was helpful to you. And if you have any questions at all, I am here to answer them. Thank you so much for watching this video. Before you click out, give this video a thumbs up if you're yet to do so and subscribe to the channel if you're yet to subscribe as well. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Step four. Still FCMB.